Um, and I was like super curious, so I came to see it and the lights didn't turn off for the first 10 minutes. And also there was like a voiceover, like a narrator for blind people. In a bathroom, Tim regards himself in a mirror. He splashes water on his face. In daylight, Tim enters the sunny foyer of a home. A young girl throws her arms around him. A blonde woman approaches. At a table, Tim sits with the girl and four boys. The children leave. The woman sits with Tim. Without looking, he puts his hand on the table. She rubs it. Are you okay? He meets her gaze. In an office, Tim faces the closed blinds of a window. He puts his hands on his hips. Behind him, a balding man at a desk, Bryant, eyes him. Come on, Tim. What? What's going on? Tim looks over his shoulder. A ton of people come out and complain it's not our fault. We have to get this situated so that everybody can feel accommodated and then we'll restart the movie, okay? We'll restart. restart the movie? Hold on. So we're standing in line with all these other people in the movie theater. We're getting refunds for the Sound of Freedom because apparently the water pressure and the bathrooms aren't working here. So no one can watch the movie. There were other people in here, and now they're all gone. And the radio's playing over the movie. Lights are still on. The radio is still playing, but they restarted the movie. Sounds off again. Look at this. In the middle of the movie, when they're about to save the children, it literally, the alarm, this alarm just starts going off. Oh my God, the glitches. Okay, now we're just sitting in an empty theater with nothing playing. Oh my god. With our projector, we had to wait for it to download the movie. Um, it's gonna be about 30 minutes. Everyone in here is gonna get a free film pass. If you wanna leave, that's understandable. I'll go do a refund, I can help you. But for now, we're gonna have to wait for the movie to download. Can you change it to another theater? Um, I don't think so. This is the only one that has it for tonight. So how do we get the free pass? You can just come to us and, and, the, and the concession store is gelato. If you want to leave, we can help you if you want to be fun. We can pass you through everything. It's going to it's gonna have to wait for 30 minutes, then we're going like to fast forward the trailer to then we're starting. Uh, can we get the free pass after the movie? Yes, you can get after the movie, yes. Uh, after everybody here, get a free pass. Even if you're not leaving or if you get a refund, I don't care. Okay. The film was glitching, then shut down. Been going to the theater all year, and this has never happened. It finally was played. There's something definitely going on. If you haven't gone to see this film yet, definitely go. Oh, yeah, they're talking about what you said. No. No se permiten hombres en la cocina. Pero las recogidas a las 7 p.m. En punto. Bueno. Bueno, mi amor. Okay. More as to why this movie in particular is not playing, and are you having issues in other theaters, or is it just the sound of freedom? So, um, our, I'm pretty sure it's 12 that it was overheating in that room. So it was. So it's just this theater you're having an issue playing movies in right now. Uh, yes, it's this auditorium. 
Okay, no surprise there. Thank you. So I personally went to go see the movie yesterday and lo and behold, there was no AC in our theater. And um, although I'd seen videos about it on TikTok, I was extremely shocked. Um, I gave them the benefit of the doubt. So I walked out of the theater and went to four other theater rooms and they were all working with AC, like a literal ice box. I would also like to include that obviously I don't have a large following. Uh, by any means, but I just felt very compelled to post something about this because I actually could not believe it. I did address the manager. I'll insert like a small clip about it. Um, they're just being very uh, vague, can't really give you any answers as to why it's not working, and it's just BS. So if we come and see it tomorrow and you guys move it into a different theater, there'll be AC? Go ahead and just ask I'm not sure. I don't know the schedule as of You're the manager. Yes. My GM is the one who does the schedule. Okay, then I'm going to be coming back every single day until this movie is out of your theaters, until that there's AC in one of the rooms. Thank you. Please ignore my shaky voice in that. I was really nervous, and I hate confrontation like that. But uh, point is, go see this movie. Screw them.